What's up everyone, it's Ben QWERTY here and today I'm gonna do a little Q&A slash update video on the editing contest that I'm doing with Nikki. Um, first of all, before we get into the questions, welcome to all the new subscribers that came over from her channel and I um, also wanted to mention a few things here. So first of all, for those who don't know or, or who are wondering, um, I got to do this edit contest with Nikki because um, she really liked some of the series I'm doing on my channel. She randomly found it and um, I'm doing a top 5 underrated edits or top 5 edits from subscribers series that um, I always brought out every 100 subs that I gain and there will be a new one for 2.3k subs and so if you're a subscriber, if you're watching this and you think um, you've got an edit that you want to send in to me uh, just feel free to and I will consider it for the next uh, top 5 edits from subscribers and uh, you can get a chance to be featured on my channel um, and usually if you're a very underrated editor um, you're also gonna get some new subs off of that and um, Nikki, Nikki is really supportive on that series and um, she decided to do an editing contest with me to get my channel more recognition and that series more recognition and yeah that's about that so um, anyone who's got some good edits um, that he wants to get more recognition for feel free to send them in for me before I hit 2.3k subscribers and um, let's actually start with the questions here so I won't do them in any specific order but since there have been a ton of questions on Nikki's video, my video and also on Twitter um, I decided to make a video about this because maybe a lot more people will have some questions too or will learn something new of this video about the contest and I didn't want to just spam the comments and reply to every single question so um, the first one is really a question but I've seen this a couple of times um, this guy was asking whether we can re-upload the intro to Mediafire because the link wasn't working on Mega. I will put a Mediafire link in the description for those who are still struggling with the link. I don't know if it's just basically not working or you forgot to enter the key or didn't find the key, but nonetheless I'll have a new link for Mediaf Mediafire in the description, so hope that works out for you. Then um, someone asked, is this only 3D? And I've seen a few questions about that actually. And obviously, it's not 3D only. Like, you can do whatever you want, whatever you're best at. And just because Nikki is an animator that does all her movies uh, in like fully 3D, doesn't mean that you, your entry has to be 3D. You can also win if you don't have any 3D in it and you have an amazing, unique edit. So, um, obviously, it's not 3D only. You can edit however you want. And the next question is, must we send the link of the video to Nikki or QWERTY? Um, this one, you don't even have to send it to us. Um, you can obviously feel free to send it to both of us on Twitter or however you like. But um, the only really important thing is that you put the right hashtag into the title of your entry on YouTube. Because um, I will be going through every single entry that I see. Uh, I'll just type the hashtag into YouTube and Twitter and see uh, what's come up recently and uh, maybe leave you some feedback so you can tweet at me but you don't have to and obviously Nikki would like you to tweet at her too. Then someone else asked if the video has to be unlisted and no it obviously doesn't have to. If you want to you can do it but um, it's obviously a lot better if it's public because if you've got a good edit um, we've got a lot more recognition through the hashtag and um, yeah, there's no reason to have it unlisted really. So this next question was one of the most popular ones in the comments. It's um, if you're allowed to edit the intro, which means uh, use different music behind it or even put effects on it. And I'm pretty sure Nikki won't mind about that. I won't mind about it. Um, I didn't get to talk to her in the past few days because she's working on a project. But feel free to like edit the intro, or put a different song behind it. Um, that won't really matter much about your in entry, but uh, make sure that you have the intro at the beginning or at the end, that's important. Uh, so this next question is a bit longer, I won't read it out to you, but basically this guy is asking if the actual intro to the edit um, counts to the 40 seconds of minimum length 
Um, obviously, if it's a self-created intro um, with 3D text and all that, how it usually is in edits, that will count to the edit. All we mean with uh, intros aren't included is team intros uh, that aren't created by you and obviously the contest intro. The next question is, can I use clips from other players? I've actually seen that question a lot and yeah, obviously you can. Um, you don't have to use your own clips, but you can if you want to, but um, some people also asked if they can use pro clips. Like I don't know if they mean competitive players with that, but uh, I don't think that would be a problem either. This guy's asking a couple of questions here. I've already answered a couple of them, but um, basically how are the winners chosen? There'll be me, Nikki, and three or four judges that will um, define who wins and who doesn't and all that sort of stuff. As yes, that's that, you can upload the video to your channel, obviously, um, already said that, and where do I submit? So there's no submission form, um, maybe Nikki will introduce one later, but as I said, I didn't get to talk to her recently, and for now just add the hashtag to your title and uh, tweet it at us if you want to. And the last question of this Q&A is coming from Shrimpy, and he asks, how do you win? So I'm just gonna try and quickly give you my opinion on this. Um, basically you just have to make a very unique and outstanding edit because a lot of people will go for this and even if you have a really high quality edit um, but it's been done like a thousand times before you obviously won't have a big chance of winning because you have to see it like this if you were to actually end up on Nikki's channel in the final results video you want to drag as many people onto your channel and go sub to you as possible and um, you're not gonna do that with a very repetitive edit that's been done a lot of times before. You're gonna do that with something new, something people haven't seen a lot before, um, something uh, that just amazes people right away. I know that's not an easy thing to do, but obviously this contest won't be easy to win. So um, I hope that answers your question and I hope that helps a few other people as well. And um, before I end of this video, I will probably be doing another q a it depends on if i get a few more questions from you guys so leave them down below if you have any more and um, there's also a couple ones i didn't answer yet because um, i want to have nikki's opinion on them first and um, she's very busy at the moment uh, working on a new project and um, i don't want to interrupt her she doesn't have much time so um, i will do a new q a soon if i get more questions and if I get the answers from Nikki. So hope you guys enjoyed this and uh, I'm going to see you in the next commentary with that sexy German accent. Bye.